What's up, everyone? I really got a big smile on my face. My wife's over there. Because I got this guy! Oh, that's too high. I don't know if you can focus on that. Focus! Anyway, it's a Sony a7 III. Took forever to get here, but I'm so excited that it's here. So I spent all day trying to change the settings on this guy, and here it is! Magical box. I got it with a kit lens, because um, I heard it was very good, and it's just so nice to, to, to have in hand, and I can't wait to explore the different features. I did uh, do some of the settings. I followed Jason Vong and Craig Adams for a video and things like that. Um, so I have the custom buttons kind of set. But overall, I'm excited uh, of the way it looks. Uh, it's much lighter, um, kind of going from Canon to Sony, so we'll, we'll check it out. Um, we'll do some sample images, and I'll give you my initial thoughts. But so far, I took a few pictures with it right now. There. And some video of me vlogging. Hey guys, how's it going? I'm talking to Lovely on the phone. We just got the Sony a7 III in hand, trying to vlog with it. I don't know what it looks like because I can't see the screen, but it'll probably be better video because I'm actually looking at the lens. So there you go. I was just so surprised seeing the, um, the amount of bokeh that comes out when you use a full frame. So it's super clear and I, uh, I vlogged in 4K so that was kind of neat and then um, setting the custom buttons here and the memory buttons for going from a 24 frames per second to a slow motion, super slow mo 120. Super buddy, buttery slow mo. That B roll is gonna be fire. Um, but actually, this flippy screen will actually benefit me when uh, when we vlog because now I'm actually gonna be looking at the lens and it'll probably look better. It'll just be difficult when framing. But I put face priority in and it looks to work out just fine. I'm gonna try out the iota focus as well, but. Um, you know, coming from a Canon 80D, which is the APS-C sensor, it's a full frame. Let's uh, check it out, what it looks like when we switch. And I'm back. And now we are on the Sony a7 III. We're just on the kit lens, uh, same focal length. Uh, we were on an 80D Sigma uh, 35 millimeter uh, f1.8. So I just realized I should have probably put it at F4, so it's a closer comparison. I'll probably do that later, but um, I hope you like the way it looks. Um, I will give a review once we have a few sample images and we're gonna take it out and we're gonna go take some portraits. Probably this weekend we're gonna do some videos, some photos and just kind of see how it goes. And I'm hoping that with the type of work that we do, which is like travel videos for personal stuff, and we do uh, weddings, um, wedding videos, and then we do like uh, photo shoots for families for different events and things like that. Hopefully, that will um, this will work out for us with all of its functionality, and I'm really excited to use it. Um, I am a little bit worried about direct sunlight and in daylight when you just can't see the screen. So that was one of the downfalls. So we'll see how that works and how we'll compensate for that. Anyway, um, that's just my initial reactions to it. Um, we'll talk about more about the features once I get to play with it, but 